What math courses are required for accounting? I've been teaching college mathematics for over nine years, and if you're going to be an accounting major, or if you know you're going to be using, studying something that will use accounting, then there are some math courses that you definitely will have to take. Now, what exactly would those courses be? Well, it really depends on the institution. So here are some examples as to some courses that you might be expected to take uh, if you're going to be studying that field of accounting. Now, at the very least, uh, most schools will want you to take algebra. Now, how far to go in algebra will really depend. Some schools are okay if you take what's called intermediate algebra, but there's going to be a lot of schools that will also want you to take uh, college algebra, which is the foundation for other math courses that you might need to take uh, in accounting. Now, assuming then that you will need to take college algebra, there's going to be an expectation that you will need to take a statistics course of some sort, generally elementary statistics. And when you think about it in accounting, they do work a lot with numbers and number crunching. So a statistics course, it does make sense. Some schools will also have you take some kind of a calculus course, but more on the business end, a business calculus or an applied calculus course. Now that's a kind of calculus course that is not as heavy duty as the five credit engineering math majors calculus. No, that's, com that's completely different. And an applied calculus or business calculus course, because accounting is part of uh, the business field, it only makes sense then that you would also need to take some kind of applied or business calculus course. If not, then you might be expected to take what's called a business mathematics course, which, you know, as the title implies, is pretty self-explanatory as to why you might need to take that. But if the course is not called business mathematics, then it might be called something called finite mathematics, which talk about math areas that actually have an ending point. So, but again, if you are, if you know you want to study accounting and you're not sure what courses you take, just uh, look at your school catalog and see what's required. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and there are some, example as, some examples of required math courses for accounting.